Hi, in this video I will show you how to edit and add to your data layer in ArcGIS Online. To start, click here where you see Show Table, and that will bring up um, your Attribute Table. And your Attribute Table will display basically every um, field for every point of your data um, as you created within a spreadsheet, um, now reflected here in the Attributes. So you can actually just go ahead and within this, go in and change anything. So if you needed to um, adjust this name, you could. Um, so if I was even to do something as simple as just add an S to that name, and then was to go down here and click on it, I will see that change reflected actually in the pop-up. All right, so I'm gonna change that back. But yeah, so that's how you can do just simple edits to your existing data. Um, now the next thing I wanna show you is that you can actually um, add data points. So let's say that I wanted to add the Stone Arch Bridge here um, to my data. So the first thing I'm going to do is go to Edit, and then I'm gonna click which type of feature to add. I'm gonna go ahead and click this, which is the uh, type of point I had selected, the field. Um, and then I'm gonna click on the Stone Arch Bridge there in the middle of it. And this will bring up um, a pop-up with all the different uh, all the different attributes listed that I have for my data. So here I'm going to skip latitude and longitude because I'm not using it to determine the point um, precisely because I already have the location pinned down there, um, but I'll add the name here. So Stone Arch Bridge. Um, and then I could add a description of this um, and then every other attribute that's here. Um, and so then if I go ahead and close this um, and then just kind of close that window as well and go back to my attributes table, you'll see that there's now a new point listed for the Stone Arch Bridge. And so you can do that to add any points you need to if there's something you think you've left out of your data that you think, to, that you, think you need to add. Um, and yeah, so you can go and you can also edit anything within there. Um, it's important that at the end you do go and save this layer um, for that change to reflect um, across any other maps you might be using that layer in, and then also save your map. Yep, so that's all. Thank you.